So I found this truck that I didn't know about and it's slowly becoming my new favourite vehicle simply because it has built in nitrous. Here she is, and the best thing about this vehicle is it looks so low key. Never in a million years would you think that this truck would have nitrous built in. Well, I'm here to say that it does. And that's what makes it dope. Oh yeah, I also forgot to tell you guys that I got a new pair of glasses, goggles, whatever they are. Come on now, you know they look cool. Okay, are you ready? Let's go, I'm gonna try backflip, oh no. Yeah, we definitely don't have enough air to do a backflip. Damn it, I think I messed up the back of the truck. Yeah, I did. Look, it's kind of dented. It's all good though, because we got nitrous, baby. Now, hands down, one of the best things about the nitrous on this truck is that it doesn't even take long to recharge. Like, you press it once, and then probably like two or three seconds later, it's ready to use again. Let me show you. So here we go, that's once, and then probably like two or three seconds later again. Now let's just say that you're chilling here, you know, you get a call from your mum saying KFC has just opened, but you haven't started the truck up yet and you're like, God damn it, it's gonna take me so long to get there. Well, no, it's not because look how fast you start up with the nitrous. With this truck, you can get KFC chicken in no time. Oh, hey, we've got a pit stop over here. Oh, someone just got kicked off the bike and another one. Whoa, that Ford Focus's door just got ripped off. What the hell? Now this guy's fleeing the scene. Yo, what just happened, they man? Just were, they were giving us a fight. Hey, I think you need a new door. I have a lot of replacement parts. This is a race car. Oh, you come prepared. Okay, stay safe, man. So he's trying to tell me that he has a spare door just laying around. I mean, who just has a spare door laying around? So this guy's in a monster truck, right? He keeps like rolling over and he's also got a friend who you can see here. They're both in matching monster trucks just rolling all over the place. I saw you rolling about. What's going on? Yeah, no, we're just new suspension, you know what I mean? Just having some fun. Let me see a barrel roll. A high speed roll, let's go. I want you to break your back. Uh-oh, there they go. <laughs> I want to know how to roll my car that easily. So, man, is that like a feature that comes with the monster truck or something? That's a new Chevy feature. It's called uh, the barrel roll button. You just kind of do a whole barrel roll when you press the button. Pretty fun, but my, my neck hurts now, so I'm going to go to the hospital. Yeah, I think that's best. <laughs> I saw that guy do like 10 or 15 different rolls, so his neck is most definitely out of place by now. My neck hurts. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, your friend just went to the hospital. Maybe you should join him. Oh, no, he did. Oh, sh I don't feel so good. Dude, I would not lay down on my bad neck. Alright, I'm good. I can get up now. That was quick. <laughs> Alright, some more barrel rolls. You going for some more barrel rolls? Dude, come on, let's take it up a notch. Let's go really fast and then do a barrel roll. So apparently he's going to go really fast and then do a barrel roll. <laughs> Yeah, he's definitely going to have to go to the hospital now. So surprisingly, his neck wasn't broken, but now he is going to do the ultimate roll. But first, we've got to get some speed. Uh-oh, here goes. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, That's a new record. God. How's your now neck feeling? Good. Uh, it hurts a lot, but it's all good. You sure, man? I mean, the state of your monster truck says otherwise. You broke your neck before then? Nah, I've never broke my neck before. Okay, well, keep going like this, and today will be your first day. That's what I'm aiming for. Actually, let's try right now. That's what you're aiming for? Why? This guy is actually trying to get a broken neck. Now everything makes sense. So why would you want a broken neck exactly? Eh, well, you know what I mean. I want to see what it is, you know what I mean? Like, how it feels and everything. Why would you want to know how it feels? No one wants to know that. I do. Man, I know how you can break your neck. You just need to get a lot more speed. Yeah, that's what I'm going for. I put turbos on and I'm going for the max speed I can get. Okay. That guy just ran into your Barbie car. Uh... Hey, it's not a Barbie car, but I did not even see him. Ah, it doesn't matter. I want to watch you break your neck. So now the crazy guy is telling me that he put turbo boosters on his car. Uh oh, here he comes. <laughs> That's got to be a broken neck. Come on. Guys, have you ever seen someone driving backwards like this? You know, just down the road, casually going backwards. What the hell is that guy doing? Why is he blocking me in? Oh, and we have a cop in front of us. I think he wants me to pull over. Is this backup now or something? 
Right, so I decided to actually pull over for this cop. I gave him my driver's license, my proof of ID, all of the documents that he needs, and now he's running them in his computer. Is there anything in the vehicle that I need to know about? Any weapons? Uh... What, in my vehicle right now? Yeah, in the vehicle right now. Hey man, can I get my ID back and my driver's license and stuff? Yeah, yeah, here, here that is. Here, here's that. Thank you very much, good sir. And to answer your question, I can't, I can't tell you that, man. I'm sorry. Too much information. I'll be right back with you, sir. Okay, sure thing. Right, so I wanted to try this out on some cops today anyway. So, now's our chance. I've got two cops chasing me down right now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn around here. Oh, yeah, they won't expect this. Oh, which way am I going? Then I'm gonna go down here. I need to get out of sight, like behind a house or something, just so they don't see me use the nitrous. So let me do a U-turn again. Perfect. They didn't expect it. Now I'm gonna go behind here, ram through the gate, and now let's use the NOS. Oh, baby. This is like perfect to get away from cops with. Oh, they caught back up. Oh no, they're trying to box me in. Sir, out of the car, hands in the air. Time to go see what San Andreas Harper Patrol. Step out of the vehicle with your hands in the air. They've boxed me in, guys. What do I do? Step out of the vehicle with your hands up. Now, guys, I don't have anything in my vehicle. What's all the guns about? Procedure, sir. Do me a favor, step out of the vehicle with your hands in the air for me. Okay, if I step out, you're not going to put me in cuffs. Uh, I can't say that won't happen. I mean, I haven't got anything illegal on me. All right, all right, I'll tell you this. I'll, I'll make you a promise. If you get out of the vehicle, we're not going to put handcuffs on you. How do I know that you're telling the truth? Uh, I don't lie. Okay, right. Hands in the air, let's go. go. Hands in the air, face away. All right, you back up to the sound of my voice. I'm going to be the one on your left. Face away from you, though. Stop, stop, stop. You're good, you're good, you're good. Yep, I knew it. Yeah, indeed. Okay, search my truck. It's a safety hazard. Oh, oh right. wow. my god. What the hell? I promised those weren't my explosives. Right, someone's getting banned. All right, Khalifa, bring out the 22, this whole thing now. I mean, I didn't have anything inside my vehicle. Now that could not have worked out any better for me. Some random guy just came over as soon as I got put in handcuffs and blew up every single vehicle in that location. So now you can call me a free man. Yo, what the hell? <laughs> not open yet. <laughs> this into a laundry man. Um, I was just wondering, do you have a washing machine I can buy? Uh, no. All these are here. You can't buy them. This guy has actually gone out of his way to fill this entire 24-7 up with washing machines. Look how many there are. Oh my god. I just asked him if I could buy one, and he said no. This guy has so many goddamn washing machines that even if I took, let's say, five of them, you wouldn't even be able to tell. Guys, am I tripping out or has this thing been here the whole time? I'm 99% sure that it hasn't been there the whole time. Now the reason I say that is look, when I use the nitrous now, a giant flame comes out the back. This flame for the nitrous just made this truck like 10 times cooler. Guys, there's a bunch of people selling drugs hey inside of here right now. I'm on top hey of the roof. The cops have yeah, just pulled way, up, takes... as you can see. Listen, I, got to, I smoke too much weed for this. Where's my brother? And it's quite chaotic. I'm just spraying this cop up as much as I can. Oh, that was a clean shot. I'll give him that. Right, I want to see if I can hit one speed boost before I hit that ramp in front of me. And then once I'm in the air, I want to try and hit another speed boost. Right, I'm going to come from under here. There we go, boost number one. Let's aim it. And boost number two. Come on, can we land it? Of course we can. You ready? Come on, perfect, perfect, perfect. Oh no, that's far from perfect. Wait, what do you think you're doing? Hey what man, do do I'm here to let you know that there can only be one of these trucks in this town. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, I mean, right? there's one of you and two of uh, us. Green hair, head ass boy. I insist you, you get the fuck out of here with that boy. Alright, tone it down a level. I'm just here telling you that you shouldn't have my truck. Put the whoa, knives whoa, whoa, away. Whoa, step into, my guy? Yeah, you've got a weapon out. I've Yo, got nothing in my hands. Come on, let's get out of here. Alright bro, just don't let, me, don't let me see you with that truck again. Yeah, out the truck, buddy. Oh, okay. Out the truck. All right, all right. Okay, yeah, yeah. All right, all right, all right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what you doing, bro? You see, that's what you get when you come to town in my truck. It's got nitrous, it's my truck, okay? 
Now, believe it or not, I just found out another feature about this truck that makes me like it twice as much. So you know how earlier on I said how this is the ideal vehicle to go and pick some KFC chicken up in? Well, that's not only because of the nitrous, but if we take a look at the trunk of this car, you can clearly see that there's a lot of room to store your chicken in there. As a matter of fact, let me know in the comments down below, I want you guys to have a guess. How many KFC chicken buckets do you think can fit in the back of this truck? Can you guys tell that I'm hungry? I've got a goddamn pizza hoodie on, and now we're here talking about KFC chicken for the second time in this video. What is wrong with me? Thank you guys very much for watching today's video. If you did find yourself enjoying it, make sure you take the time to slap a like on it, as when I see a video with lots of likes, that lets me know that you guys are enjoying them. If you happen to be new around here, do consider hitting that subscribe button down below and turning post notifications on, as I upload videos here every single day that I definitely think you'd enjoy.